Fox Urgent now, and prosecutors in Los Angeles are charging Michael Jackson's personal doctor with involuntary manslaughter. Investigators now say Dr. Conrad Murray gave the star a shot of a powerful anesthetic that contributed in the end to his death. And over many years, we have been, uh, well, over the last few months at least, we've been waiting for this decision to come down. Uh, let's get to Adam Housley with the news. He's live in Los Angeles at the courthouse. You know, it feels as though we went through all of this on Friday, Adam. Yeah, Shepard, it does feel like that, but today it's finally happening. But we had the run through on Friday, as you talked about. I just been handed a five page copy of what was filed officially about 20 minutes ago or within the last 20 minutes. In fact, the Jackson family has just arrived here, Shepard, as you were talking about Congress and Mirtha. Uh, the Jackson family, uh, Jackson's mother, his father, uh, Jermaine, Latoya, and some other members of the family went into the courthouse. We've been told they have 10 seats inside for the arraignment, which will take place this afternoon. As you mentioned, Dr. Conrad Murray, Jackson's personal physician, the man who was with him the night he died last June has been charged with involuntary manslaughter. Most legal experts say it's going to be a tough case to prosecute, but it's the easiest charges that could have been filed in their mind. Now, if he does uh, get a conviction in this case, he would potentially face a maximum of four years in state prison if convicted. Uh, Jackson, it says, was stricken. This is according to the press release from the district attorney's office. Jackson was stricken at his North Carrollwood home on June 25th uh, and was pronounced dead later at the UCLA Medical Center. They say that the doctor Conrad Murray did unlawfully, this is a quote, and with without malice kill Michael Joseph Jackson in commission of an unlawful act. That's in part of this release, Shepard. We know that the doctor will be brought here by his defense team. I've spoken with them in the last half an hour. They still plan on bringing him here about an hour and 10 minutes from now where he will turn himself in, Shepard, in this case, will proceed. Shepard. Adam Housley live in Los Angeles. Adam, thanks.